Well, you made it this far. How are you feeling? Um, we're feeling uh, actually pretty good. We had a test earlier today, so we're all kind of a little uh, tired and a little nervous from the, uh, doing the test earlier, but we feel good right now. Yeah, so you're confident. Uh, what's your strategy for winning today? Well, pretty much our strategy is rather simple. We're going to fly. <laughs> um, really, there's no... We, we already did our little planning and um, did the cost effectiveness of carrying one egg or two eggs and four eggs. So that's already done. All, in, all we need to do now is just go up there and go in the air. So getting off the ground is your goal today? That is our primary goal. Uh, so what is the most notable feature of your aircraft? What, what advantage do you have over the other teams? Um, I, I feel we we were one of the few teams that actually uh, looked throughout the the spectrum of what would be the most effective way of carrying eggs. Because in this competition, it's not just time endurance, but how much how many eggs you carry per t per how much time. Mm -hmm. So if you carried four eggs for two minutes, that'll be eight points carrying. But if you carried two eggs for four minutes, that would also be eight points. And I feel we were one of the few teams that actually did that. that so so what configuration did you did you choose? Uh, we chose to uh, have two eggs uh, towards the, towards the, have a, underneath the center of gravity of the center of mass of the plane. We feel that would be best. So you've been working uh, on this project as a team for most of the semester. The rest of your team is currently uh, loading up your eggs. Uh, what what do you think was the most enjoyable part of the process? Uh, the most enjoyable part, I think, it was just us coming together and just talking because, like, our, our meetings weren't as efficient as they could have been. But uh, <laughs> we still, we had a lot of fun. Like, um, I got to learn uh, some of the people in my class, from, like, on a more intimate level. Um, I could call them uh, friends. I could just, like, hang out with them. In fact, me and uh, uh, Lynn, the, um, the girl over there, she's, we're going to go to the mall either this weekend, this weekend or next weekend to um, go shopping together. Great. Uh, what was the toughest part about engineering this system? Um, I think it was the wings because at first we we designed something. We designed a wing that seemed, in theory, was correct, but it seemed that in practice it was harder. It was it was a correct uh, thing in theory, but when we actually tried to fly it, it was in like it was too difficult for us to fly. So we uh, we had to change it, and so there was this whole thing of theory, like in theory, this would be the best way, but in, in practicality, we can't fly this. <laughs> we're, just, we're not that good. We don't have the 240 hours or whatever amount of hours it takes to learn how to fly, things like this. Sounds like a valuable lesson. Well, good luck with the flight. Thanks very much for talking with us. Thank you.